know, after we get, come, come back from a bad call, uh, if we could just kind of relax, get our mind off the call, um, what happened, what we could have probably done better, or, you know, what um, could have changed. Um, it's nice just to come back home, maybe get your mind off pet a dog, and kind of relax and get our minds off things. I'm born and raised in Hanford, uh, so it's actually pretty awesome that I can get back to my community and work for the department that I've been born and raised in. Yeah, I'm also from Hanford as well. The one in the red harness, this one's Tiller, and uh, the other one's Asher. So it's kind of cool, and that kind of inspired me to look into a program like this for our department. It's actually learning our stressors even right now. So they're really young, but they can still read the different stress between stress to going to an incident and then stress to coming back from a rough incident. Hear about um, first responders committing suicide. Um, and that's something that we want to battle. Uh, my name is Chris Duchesne, and this is my dog, Dodge. I joined the Navy in 85, uh, ended up in Lemoore. I was the Aviation Maintenance Administration. He was three years old when I got him, and uh, he passed his canine good citizenship, and he recently just passed his uh, public access test and so now we're starting to work on tasks. The dogs for the first responders are more of therapy dogs where they kind of, they just their presence is supposed to help make everybody feel better. With our service dogs that we train for our veterans, they are specially trained to mitigate the disability that the veteran has. And so uh, maybe go get their bag of medicine for them if they need it or turn the lights on if they're, if they're nervous about going into a dark room. He, he really, emotionally, he really pulled me out of a dark place. With him, it gives me more confidence to go out and about when he's with me. He's a comfort. You know, right now there's a lot that's been going on lately between um, the virus and everything else just going on, but one beautiful thing with these dogs is everybody just, just comes together with these dogs. Everybody supports them. You know, it just gets your mind off of things. So, um, it just, I mean, hopefully this is one of those things that just kind of helps to you know, bring us back together again. I know it's going to benefit us, it's going to benefit the community, and it's going to benefit uh, the local neighboring agencies. So I'm just kind of excited to see where this takes off and uh, how it could benefit everyone else. Yeah.